All right, welcome back. Star Wars Racing Incorporated. Got Lorik 7 in the background. This is the update for Quali Day 2. It's not a good one, unfortunately. Uh, engine was running beautifully. Went out on the uh, went on the uh, hardship lap, and that was pretty nice and smooth, no problem. Came back in, just got ready, you know, for the uh, quality two. Went out, no problem. Warm up lap, no problem. Took the green, no problem. Um, and. Uh, just you know, took the green about half, half, uh, the first half lap, and the car just shut down, and uh, and it wasn't turning, it wasn't trying, you know, I couldn't. The starter was not turning. The starter was turn, trying to turn, but the engine was not turning, so it was stuck. So we have a locked engine there. It looks like the front bearing might have gotten stuck, according to a couple of the guys that came over to help. So we are, but we have a spare engine. So let's work on that. Let's put that in. Just gotta bring some components from this engine and rock and roll. I had to give it a thought. I had to sit down and wait for about 30, about 45 minutes. Then I went to eat. That was another 30 minutes or so. And then, and then go time, you know, so. It's, uh, it's definitely a punch below the belt, so. But you know what, we're here, so <laughs> might as well give it a shot, you know, and that's why we bring a spare engine. It, it stinks that this happened, especially the engine was sounding just beautiful. There was no warning, no nothing. All of a sudden the engine just shut off, no smoke, no nothing. And apparently it, it got locked, so. I don't know. We'll open it up and see what happened, but definitely see some shavings in the uh, front cover area. So definitely. So that's the update. Then let's get a little closer here. Lorex Seven still looking pretty shiny. Now hasn't put a lot of work. So we got the engine almost out. Well, I, all the components are out. I mean, and uh, just need to really unhook it from the transmission, and then uh, get the pulley and. A couple guys help me out, or we'll get it out. So, and then uh, we have to move the front cover from this one to the other one, change the oil pan, and put it back in. So, just gonna need some help with that front cover. So, we'll, we'll find some help with that. Uh, take some technique and, and knowledge to do that. But once that's done, I can do the uh, the rest of it. So, let's get to it. Just a quick update. Uh, hopefully, everything works out. I gotta have the engine in. Uh, definitely want to do it tonight. I mean, there I'm doing it tonight. You know, obviously it's happening tonight. So tomorrow, you know, we can start it and warm it up, and uh, maybe do another hardship lap tomorrow, and then do some quality laps. I think they're gonna be one of the slowest quality laps ever. But you know, I, you know, I mean, maybe I don't. I mean, it's a motor that's been working, so maybe I don't need to worry too much. But you know, probably we'll take it easy, anyways. And then, you know, press a little bit towards the middle end. And just to have a decent time, I have to meet certain requirements. So we're going <clears> to <throat> go ahead and do that. But that's what's going on here. Let's get to work. It's, you know, I, I have my neighbors. They've changed two engines already. So, and a tranny. And then a good friend lost, the, uh, lost their uh, differential. They didn't have another one. So they're going home. And that happens all the time at the runoffs, you know, it stinks, but that's why you come prepare. And uh, just hope for some help and uh, get it done, you know. So I had some good, good, good lunch. Thank you to Miss Andrea Smelly from Florida, Mike Smelly's wife. She fed me the whole week a lunch and, and I appreciate that. And that lunch really brought me up. And uh, thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart because I was like, uh, and uh, so that that did it so let's go all right more updates hopefully tonight or tomorrow morning and let's hope for the best that's how that's how it's done that's why the run happened you know there's the uh this is the area of my car i didn't want to touch this is all the spare stuff but the engine's right here we're gonna have to pull it out and 
and and let's get it done all right that's it star wars racing incorporated